Welcome to Fun with Drilling Engineering. Today we want to explain how we actually make curves while drilling. On our drill string, we have different sensors that tell us where we are in the ground. So we always know how deep we are, what inclination we have, and to what direction we are heading. This set of sensors are called Measurement While Drilling Sensors, MWD. We also have another set of sensors called logging while drilling. These sensors help us to know whether we are in a sandstone or clay or whether the rock is porous or not and what exactly is in this rock, oil, gas or water. The information is continuously sent upwards to the team on the surface. The data is evaluated and the decision is made whether to drill straight ahead or to change direction to the left, to the right, top or bottom. Commands are now sent back into the borehole over several kilometers through the drill string. The drill string rotates from the top to the bottom, but there is a device that does not rotate to the drill string, a steering sleeve located close to the drill bit and has three steering ribs on its outer diameter. These steering ribs are pressed against the borehole walls. This is why the steering sleeve does not rotate with the remainder of the drill string. In order to steer the well in any desired direction, the steering sleeve is pushed against the borehole wall. I can demonstrate this with my arms. So, depending on which direction I want to drill, I just need to press my arms against the opposite side of the borehole. This is how we can steer into any desired direction, to the left, to the right, top or bottom. In front of our institute, we have a real model of this device. Let's take a quick look at that. We can see clearly here, first the bit, then the yellow part which rotates to the drill string, and then the blue part, a non-rotating steering sleeve with the three silver steering ribs. If you want to know more details about this, come to our lecture, Drilling Engineering 2, here in Freiburg. Look off.